Hey everyone, welcome back to the vlog. Just been uh, doing a bit more DIY renovation on my boat today, seeing the beautiful sun is out. It's a glorious day. Perfect for cruising, but uh, I'm just doing a bit of DIY. <clears throat> um, when I renovated my boat, um, you know, my DIY skills aren't that crash hot. I mean, I've done okay in designing this sort of set of cockpit bit with the doors and all that kind of stuff. Um, as you can see, I have put in, you know, some insulation, some rigid insulation. But what I've found is this is a particular area that um, does, is gets a bit drafty. There's a few gaps and things like that, particularly around, you know, the, whether between the doors and the wall and things like that. I'm not a, you know, <clears throat> like I said, I'm not a professional carpenter or anything like that. So um, what I've done is I've installed these thermal curtains. Um, and you might be thinking, oh, well, how do you, how does that work when you're cruising? I said, well, all I have to do is literally just take off this and just drag this back and clip it around my little hook there, like so. And then when I've stopped cruising and I want to settle down for the night, I just put that back, clip that over the clip there. Um, and I've even cut out a little hole down there for the cat flap so the kitties can get in and out. And I've done the same on the opposite side, over here, same again. Um, and these are thermal curtains too, so <clears throat> you might be surprised to learn that thermal curtains actually make an enormous difference um, into keeping heat into a, into a space. Um, and also, on the flip side, in the heart of summer, when it does get really hot, um, they will help keep the cabin cool. I've also done the same at the back because one of the things I've noticed when particularly on cold, really cold days is um, <clears throat> this, this area here isn't as insulated as parts of the rest of the boat. So uh, again, I've added, <clears throat> while I've got, I do have thermal curtains here right on the window. Um, there's these grey things here. There's a <clears throat> they're all thermal curtains. Um, I have added an extra set of curtains. Um, to cover that whole, basically the whole back wall. And obviously, you know, I can pull that back, you know, whenever I need to get access to either the engine or my new little refrigerator down there. <laughs> um, but it will make an enormous difference to um, the warmth of the cabin and uh, will help keep all the heat in. It's amazing how much heat you actually lose through things like windows. Um, and especially this sort of rear cabin bit isn't as insulated as I'd like it to be. Um, <clears throat> I will be doing a little bit of that, a um, little bit of extra stuff on that over the next few weeks. Um, but that is an area where I've felt um, a great deal of cold coming into the boat. So the thermal curtains will help greatly. Um, so if you've got any questions on that, please up below. Um, <clears throat> you can see here again, like I've put in... Um, these are the roughest curtains you'll ever see on the cut. Um, but I basically cut down an entire curtain to make these little curtains. And it does, it makes a huge difference. Even in summer, like I said, um, it will make an enormous difference. So again, if I've got any questions on that, please sing up below, more than happy to answer them. See you later.